we have the Treasury Awards. Uh, we decided to implement from the board four Treasury Awards for the high performers, as we, we call them in the association. You know, we are a non-profit uh, association. We're doing it on the side from our, our normal uh, job. And um, yeah, we appreciate every minute and every hour that every member is spending uh, uh, in helping us. Uh, we have four categories that we would like to discuss, and then we have the HAT Treasury Innovation Award. I will explain a little bit how that works. The HAT Bright Initiative Award, uh, and we can go there, uh, will be given to a colleague uh, that actually took an idea and make it very uh, a full product, uh, as we say it. Uh, he really delivered, uh, motivated everyone in, in the group. Uh, to me, I think without him, uh, we wouldn't be uh, excelling in that uh, area. And the award goes to Nikos Polimenakos. <laughs> so I would like to invite Nikos on stage. And also to tell us a little bit of, uh, of the blockchain. Uh, what can do? Thank you very much. Thank you very much, uh, Nico. Well, thank you very much for this. Uh, it's been really uh, an honor for me. Uh, it, w it, w it would be not a lie to say that th this result was completely lack <laughs> today. Uh, the basic element was Mariana, who was a connection link between this fantastic guest that uh, came to Athens. Uh, the confidence from the board and you personally, and uh, we aspire to keep at least at the same level because this level was <laughs> beyond any expectation. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. We have now, we're moving to the next award, is the High Contributor Award. Um, we have some areas uh, within HAT that we are uh, quite established in terms of knowledge. We have, uh, for example, cash management, corporate finance, things that every day-to-day -day treasurer is doing uh, at work. Uh, the question is how can you take something that you know that you're doing it at work and elevate it? Uh, you, you can dedicate more time, do more, more things, uh, educate uh, more people, educate the members, um, the colleague who's going to take the award, uh, Excel, uh, again, it's all Excel, but uh, <laughs> uh, the specific one uh, did a really great job in uh, contributing on the association. Uh, she had the greatest output uh, from the working groups in terms of delivering um, webinars, uh, sessions, uh, treasury corners, and from the team uh, motivating each other. And, the, and I'm going to open it this time so you can see it. I'm going to put it here. Uh, the HAT High Contributor Award goes to Elisa Milona. <laughs> I'm going to invite Elisa Milona. Uh, Elisa is the group treasurer of OTE. She's also the head of the Corporate Finance and Risk Management Working Group. Thank you very much. I think this goes to the team also. Thanasis, George, Angela sitting over there, Pericles. Uh, I think I see Constantino somewhere at the bottom. Giannis, Giannis, Giannis. We have three Giannis there. <laughs> and uh, Dimitris. I think, uh, I hope I'm not uh, forgetting anyone. Uh, it's true that we have done quite a few things during uh, the last months. And uh, th this is very important. Uh, if you take also into account that we're a lo there were many things happening in parallel in our lives. Uh, I think three or four members changed jobs. Uh, two members became fathers <laughs> for the first time. Alexander, I forgot about you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, so um, it, it was quite demanded, but m we managed. And, but uh, what is uh, coming next? Uh, I know that there is a very exciting pipeline of uh, projects and ideas. Maybe Alexandros will share more uh, in the next period. Uh, but I think for all this to come into life, uh, it is very important that we have as many members as possible active in the association. 
Uh, obviously, time is uh, not enough for anyone being in this auditorium. You said it as well. Uh, but from in my view, it pays off to be active in this great community. Uh, so I would really like to encourage all members to, to be engaged in uh, any activity that is uh, closer to their interests. And uh, I think uh, we have a lot of uh, good things happening uh, in the next years. So thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're moving to the third award. Uh, we have the Young Leadership Award. Um, this award is going to be dedicated or to be awarded to a, a colleague uh, and also a HUD, board, a HUD member uh, that is putting a lot of energy, a lot of effort. I, I think this colleague has a star <laughs> in, uh, in presenting and uh, organizing the team. Uh, I don't want to say more. I think probably you know who I'm talking about. Uh, I'm going to open the award again, put it here, and the award goes to George Murgios. George is the head of the ESG group, Environmental, Social and Governance, Assistant Treasurer in Sunny and ECOS. It's like an Oscar award winning, right? I want to thank my mom, my dad. <laughs> okay, I, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. So uh, thank you all for, uh, and thank the board, thank, uh, thank very much the board, of course, for uh, all these arrangements on, on the hat uh, thing. I would like, of course, it's like a cliche, just like Elisa mentioned, but this is actually a word is more uh, a wolf pack mentality uh, word, and I would like, of course, to thank uh, the, the rest of the nine members of the ESG team. I think Alexandros, Mariana, I can see uh, Vasilis, uh, he's on the back, and many members. And um, okay, we have uh, too many projects and initiatives in our mind for the next uh, months, years to come. And uh, the thing is that we need more people on our team and uh, we have strong appetite and uh, I believe that uh, we will try to, to, to accelerate in terms of uh, progress on the ESG section. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. And we are continuing. Last but certainly not very least, the take it on and make it happen. Um, you know, in HUD, we, we have the working groups, as I mentioned, we have the committees, uh, we have people that they are behind the scenes, that they are doing a lot of work, they, and uh, I would like to recognize a lot, uh, a very important person who actually organized a very big part of this uh, event. Uh, I'm going to welcome on stage Lorelai Hadzitoliu. Lorelai is the head of the events committee and she organized quite a lot of uh, Thank this. You Thank you. Um, Thank you. During my professional career, there were uh, numerous circumstances that have tasked uh, to achieve goals. Uh, started from uh, only an idea. Uh, it is the first time that I have been awarded for the efforts that I used to make in order to reach the successful completion of the task. Therefore, I would like to thank you for uh, the award. It's, it's an honor for me, since it's a recognition of the minor contribution to the success and enlargement of HAT Association. Also, I would like to thank you, the Academy, for all the cooperation and support in order to make this event happen. Thank you very much. Perfect, then we're going to continue with the Treasure Innovation Award, which for this year it's a new category. It's the uh, same award, actually the, the same process followed as last year, uh, Ileana went to, to Brussels uh, with uh, her project. Uh, going forward each year, each company uh, or the, the people that they want from HUD, uh, the colleagues, they can submit their project, their innovation uh, that they are doing within their own business. Um, we're going to communicate the process in the following weeks. Uh, the, the voting will take uh, place online. 
and the winning will be uh, headed to Brussels this year that we have the EACT summit in 2023 to represent Greece and to represent HAT, the Hellenic Association of Treasurers. So we are very happy to introduce this category, uh, this award, and it's an award that you're going to vote uh, to represent our association.